Uh, hey, buddy! Would you like to be a suit for my plantation? Nope. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that was just way too perfect. Okay, fine. I see. Um, right. So, I mean, there's not really anything to do. Is this a workbench? Oh, a farmer's workbench. Oh! We could build stuff. Animal pens that allows cow, goats, and chickens to be... Oh, right. Apiary. Blacksmith. Okay, 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 okay. So we need iron ingots, firewood, hinge, iron fittings, core stone. Like, we don't even have a place to do none of this. In exterior, build a cottage for your hired help. Increases the productivity of the farm. <gasps> oh. Oh. Okay. Does that mean that that's what I have to do first? Build a stable. Allows a horse to be purchased for the farm. Nice. Okay. Upgrades the silo into a windmill and adds a grain mill for turning wheat into flour or straw. Hmm. Okay. Well, I mean, I don't really have any of this right now. And I still don't know how to hire a stewardess unless it's by making the bunker. But still, I don't have the equipment for that. I do have some of it, but just not all of it. But good to know. I mean, this is completely distracting me from <laughs> my original. Like, I mean, look at this. We, we're we still, like, super close from work, so we haven't even moved from there. Like, kill the leader of the serpent. Oh, all right. Um, hmm, no, we do have that. And, yeah, let, let's keep on going till we get here and until we get to, to Whiterun. And then I want to go back. I still want to look into Riverfall Cottage, to be honest with you. I am tempted, though. I mean, it is... We, we have it now. Um, but still. Uh, and because I have to go back to Riverwood. So let's uh, try to not get too distracted. Oh, I should find a steward to manage my day-to-day -day operations. Perhaps one of my allies will be willing to take the job after I show them the place. Or if I were to get married, I could make this place our home and my spouse could run the farm. I mean, should we ask her? Amelie! I'm ready if you are. Yeah, um... You seem like somebody who appreciates nature. Oh yes, the water, the animals, the trees, all clay which develop molds into indelible art. And at the heart of every explorer is an admirer of that beauty. Right. Yes, and like the explorer, we must map and spread word of our findings. That's the spirit, but don't just spread the word, shout it. Scream it from the pit of your stomach. If I see an ear, I lend it my voice, so that it'll ring inside for all eternity. Yeah, okay. Okay, we can't use her, but maybe if we find somebody else. This reminds me. <laughs> Where's our horses? Oh, shoot. Uh, We forgot our horses somewhere. <gasps> oh, right. That's because we lost it with the going to mark our thing a majigi with sam right uh wait where were we when we started drinking i actually think riverwood right no oh my god i can't remember i can't i was way too drunk to remember anything um i'm curious to see what's up there and then at the same time that kind of tells me that i shouldn't you know? There's just so many people on the roads. It's kind of cool. Um, why is there so many giants here? I'll keep your ass. Please don't anger anybody! <sighs> why are you attacking every single living thing? What is this? Oh. Locate the Saint Bandit's camp. Defeat the Saint That's Bandit's leader. No. Nope. Sorry, apparently I have to, to defeat you. Yeah. 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 
meanie. Oh. Is it? Am I doing any good or anything? No. You busted. Right. Um. I feel like I really suck. By the gods that hurts. Right. Who's shooting? Uh, are you okay? Hold on. I think I can heal you. If I get enough magic. Yeah, there you go. I totally am not looting before. I know better. I'm done fighting. I mean, you see, you see why, why, why does it even matter? Like, by the time I get here, it's over with. I will take stuff just because I can. Who's shooting golden arrows? Like, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna take that. Where, where's the body? Where did you kill? There you go. Golden arrows, golden bow, golden dagger, golden gauntlets, golden cheese. I don't know what that was, but okay. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to return all that. Golden Saint armor. Saint Bandit's cage key. Scroll of milestones. Place up to five teleportation anchor and teleport freely between them? <gasps> what? That is pretty cool. Oh, what the hell is that? Uh. Free the Elantra Nip. Uh, are you okay? Did they hurt you? I can't just leave you here. Maybe you could follow me. Uh, alright, let's go. Okay, that was a pet. Come on. Ooh, silver stuff, coin purse. I'm I'm just gonna take things just because I can, right? Like why are they all decked up in in gold? Notes on the blacksmith. And Saint Bander Leader's journal. Okay. Notes on the blacksmith. Find Jofton's note on blacksmithing golden dart. Okay. Our blacksmith, Jofton, has gone mad. Most of the time he spouts nonsense. This all started three days ago. Now he won't even pick up his hammer. We've tried to talk sense into the loot, but it's like he doesn't even see us. He wrote down the means to forge our golden arms and armors, and that of the seducers, but he never told a soul where he left the blasted notes. If we weren't holding out hope that he might snap out of it, we would have already parted his head from the rest of him. Lately, he's been going on about playing under the bridge like he were still a child. That's where I always hid my toys, he said. I know it's kin used to live around Half Moon Mill. We should round up some folks to have a look. Oh, maybe that's where he hid it. There's a good chance. Oh, there's- wait, wait, wait. There's still another journal. Completed. Read the Saints and Bandits Leader's journal. Locate Kinthal's Saint Bandit Camp. Now this is what I call easy coin. I'm proud to be one of the saints. Every few days, Rasaz comes down the road and his wares are ours for the taking. We don't take everything, mind you. If he don't got nothing to sell, he can't stay in business. And then, where would we be? We just skim a bit off the top each time. Kinthal should be happy with our latest take. He'll be leaving his camp up near Hartwiston to pay us a visit soon. Those damn seducers were eating into our profits until we drove them off up north. Other merchants pass through those parts, so maybe they'll stay gone. Right? So, we can find another camp. 
don't mind. I mean, it's all golden stuff. So, do I really want this gold? I don't know if they're really worth selling or anything. Golden, golden. I didn't even notice everything was golden. Okay. Well, that's one thing down. Oh, no. We have something else further up? I hear something. Right? Oh yeah, there's there's a troll. There's a lot of trolls. Oh, that's probably where I have to go. All right. Um <laughs> I I mean it's on the way, okay? I, I really don't know why he's doing that. What was that? I don't know if I want to be here, to be honest with you. What is over there? Is that... Is that Skelly's? Do I want to be here? I don't know. What was this mission for? Okay, I I have no idea. What beauty! What a sight! Another gift from the gods. Yeah. <laughs> ah, ow! Is that a guys? It's a skeleton. Whoa! I actually got him. <laughs> I hear, I hear singing, but do I have, no, I don't think I have anything. Get lost in your studies there. Well, I mean, I, I have some stuff, but I don't really want to. Oh, I can break it down and probably, I can apply it to this one though. But it's kind of cool that we can break those things down. I'm no fun of manji. Good to know. What can I say? I like how your mind works. Thank you. I like when you compliment me. <laughs> but, I mean, if he's flirting, I'm gonna flirt back. Well, I will take that, but... Like, should the singing be a good thing? Or should it be something that I should be scared about? I wonder what twisted experiments those mages get up to. I don't know, but I do agree with you that some people really do some weird stuff with magic. Um... No? Okay. I, I... We must show these warlocks the error of their ways. We must make them peace locks, agents of good. Shh, I'm wait. I'm not sure how. Uh... Should, should I be worried? Is this, I mean... running about i'm sorry i'm sorry it's just like what with this fist yeah you don't set a chance Ooh, i will take oh i will take i will take all of these mind you so who was it no one i had a silver necklace but too many people meddling with forces they can't understand Hey, you really have something against um, magic, don't you? You heard that? Totally not creepy. Right. Okay. So, who were you? Oh, 
a necromancer. But you don't really have anything here. Let me relieve you of all this. Ooh, conjuration. Don't mind if I take that. And draining. Ooh, that's a pretty cool enchantment, though. I just want to grab these things, yeah? Yeah. Let's uh disenchant that. Oh, it's just magical damage? Oh, I thought it was like a health or something. That would have been cool. Alright, let's disenchant you. Alright, the rest I do want to kind of keep. Until I figure things out more. But who was singing? Ragged clothes. Oh. Who are you? Do you mind keeping that closed? Uh, what? You mean the cage? Why, yes. It's quite comfortable in here. But when it's open, there's a bit of a draft. Oh, but, but the, the cage door has holes in it. You do realize that was a joke, don't you? Oh, oh. I didn't expect my hero to lack a sense of humor. <laughs> well, I was expecting somebody more dashing. What? I don't, I don't want to say that. So you'll come out of the cage then? Maybe. I'd grown quite fond of it. The iron bars, the pattern of squares, and... Well, I guess that's it. But I do like squares. Right? What's your name? My name is Zora Fairchild. Although it was never meant to be ironic. I was once very much a child, and very much fair. So fair, in fact, that the divine saw it fit to punish me with the smart and unviable face. It's always easier to blame the gods for such things, isn't it? What's wrong with your face is fine? I, why what? Why why is it so, like so mean to her? Is that because of her scar? Why actually I think you're beautiful. She's beautiful. What's wrong? Like I I what do people have really that bad taste? You were a bad liar, but I appreciate the sentiment. Okay, was the necromancer who marred your face? Oh no, necromancers tend to disapprove of having their specimens damaged. I should know. This is the eleventh necromancer who's enslaved me, and all eleven have been as delicate as a lord is with his finest furs. It hmm. makes me so sad to disappoint them so. I think this last one was quite excited with his find until he brushed back my hair. <sighs> I've seen that look on more than enough men to recognize it. Eleven times? You, you can't be serious, right? Oh, I am. I do enjoy it. There is never a shortage of wizards who like to use this pass as their lair. Nor a shortage of heroes who travel through it. What? What? Where were you headed when you were captured? I was on my way north to the icy tundra. It's quite vast, quite icy, and extremely dull. Which is precisely why I visited it. Okay. Some people look at a blank portrait and see only emptiness. I see an opportunity to paint. Alright. And what do you mean by that? Imagine a vast field of pure white, soft as a pillow wrapped in a cloud. From a distance, you might think it's snow. Yet, when you come to the lip of its feathery shore and run your fingers through crowns of ivory, you'll know you have arrived in Whiterun. Home of Tamriel's most beautiful and profitable Tundra Cotton Field. Zora's Field, as it's known to the locals. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure the giants will just let you plant away. That's a concern. I can't have them tromping through the very fields I planted. But that's why the Divines invented heroes and cell swords. True. So what sort of rescuer were you waiting for? Well, handsome, but not cute. Funny, but not mean. Tender, but not soft. Strong, but not violent. Caring, but not servile. I could go on and on, 
Yes, by giving two opposites. Oh, no, for the love of the divines, please don't. Are you sure? You sound like the sixth hero who saved me. Aggressive, but impatiently so. <laughs> that one had barely unlocked the cage before unloosening his belt. Oh, God. No, 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 no. You carry a large weapon for a girl your size. It's not just for show. Although the necromancers seem to think so. Nobody takes me seriously. Yeah. Huh, but when my weapon of choice was an amulet of Mara, then the boys were quite certain of my intentions. Even if that was just for show. <laughs> well, do you have a lot of experience with two-handed weapons? It took some time to get the hang of it. My body did pay quite a price for my lessons. I have more scars than skin now, I'm afraid. Hmm. Yet you'll find I'm a capable fighter. And if it's adventure you seek, my lord, I am but your humble servant. The fury to your Holger, the Edward to your Barenzaia, the house girl to your Jarl. I actually already have one of those, but I'll consider it. Just try not to get in my way, because so, <clears throat> it might get to hurt a little bit. I can knock an arrow as swiftly as I can sever a head, but it's not nearly as fun. Yeah, no. As a Breton, I also have a knack for spells, although I'm not the prodigy my sister was. I <laughs> mean, I'm not gonna judge you, so follow me. I could use your help. I'm sorry, my hero, but you have someone with you. And out on the road, it can get quite crowded. Oh, right, right, right. Until next time. Um. <laughs> she ran away because she knows. Oh. Hi, sweetheart. Do you need something? Items? Potions? Hugs? I've got it all. Yeah, um, how about... I need to trade things with you. Certainly. I'll take any necklaces if you have them. The soldier of Debella must always look her best. Just want to take the orcish sword? No, actually, it's just a sword. I could leave it for her. Or actually... Okay, fine. Keep it. But I'm sorry. At last, it is time for us to part ways. Yes, onward. Only in separate directions. I guess what I'm saying is... Safe travels, friend. Safe travels... Oh. Right. Where did she? Where? She just went on. Uh. Damn. Okay, she could definitely handle herself for sure. Uh, and there's even bandits, and she didn't even move. Right. Uh, hello. Excuse me. Well met. Uh, now will you follow me? You have my steel. Awesome. Woohoo. Uh, oh. Don't mind me. I just, uh, think something sometimes. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, that's it. Okay, good. I keep forgetting that there's a possibility of them being uh, trapped, but you know me. I see a chest and I lose all sense of uh, uh ooh, oh, um so Who put that there? No one? It's just, uh Okay. There could have been somebody, but no. Then out we go. A cave. A perfect place to get trapped. And even a better place to be rescued. <laughs> right. Because <laughs> it's totally not where you come out of. So where are we? Where is this place? Oh, I know where we are. Well, I wanted to s 
stop by Riverwood. I guess we could do that now. Hello. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be. It's great. You and me, we're the only people around who aren't complete fools. Right. Okay. I actually need to see what you got for sale. Take a look. This place sells a lot of junk. Yeah, but apparently he has the junk that I'm looking for. Or maybe you don't? Hmm. Huh. All right, then. It's a fine day with you around. I was sure. Reckon we don't sell silver buckles, do we? One of the customers was asking. I'm afraid not. You had a question? Well, I was thinking Some say gems are Agara's best friends. I doubt you would sell your best friend for money. True. Oh, the horn of Jürgen Wundkaller. The Greybirds want me to fetch a horn. That's just any horn. The horn of Jürgen Wundkaller. I wonder what happens if he blow it. Hmm. It would be too tempting not to. True. Which is why it's best if you hold on to it. Huh? If I see a button, I have to press it. Yeah. If I see a lever, I have to pull it. Yeah. If I see a horn, I will make it play music. This place sells a lot of yeah. so it's not good if the buttons and levers have traps. And if the horn summons a dragon. <laughs> <laughs> At least that's what the tales see magic horns do. Uh -huh. Good thing that you told me that, because I would have been tempted to try it out. So, uh... Ooh, only if it did. Imagine all the dragon souls and bones we could harvest. My leash likes to live dangerously. Yeah. I'm not the one to object. But what if they all come at once? Oh. Still, if you plan on blowing the horn anyway, I suppose it will not do any harm if I do so as well. Yes. Oh, Riverwood, how does it feel to be back home? Does the stone look different at all to you? No. Seems the same to me. Yes, I bet Sigrid is still hectoring Calvary like a pet dog. And speaking of which, it's good to see Stump is still alive, too. I forget how he got his name. I think it's because he's always curled about like a stump. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Two hands are better than one. Right. Of course. So, I was pretty sure that I was supposed to get a book there, but apparently not. Oh, wait. And I also see that we can level up. So we have a lot of magicka. Um, but I still, I still feel like we need more. And I still don't know what to put my points in because our conjuration is still not that great. Nor is our destruction magic. So we'll stick to it for now. Okay, it's still not available there. What? Okay. I have legendary DX armor installed. Apparently, I should be able to get the manual from him, but it doesn't seem like I can. Okay, I'm baffled. I guess we'll find out another time. Like, I'm supposed to get a manual from him for me to craft my first armor, and as I level up, I should be able to get a newer manual, but I'm not getting it. Okay, so while we are in White Run, we have two things that we need to do. One of them is to return the sapling that we have. Hopefully it will be a good thing. Um, she's either out here or in here. I'm going to assume she's probably in here. So... Oh, there you are. are you up for hire? Travel with me and I'll pay you. Oh, isn't that the guy that was super angry of me trying to cut? No? I guess she's not here. So that has made you thin, and the gods have named you Dragonborn. Don't forget your friends now that you are famous. No, of course not. Do you have the other being sad? Yes, 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 I was looking for you. Unfortunately, that is it for today's episode. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. And of course, subscribe if you're not subscribed already so that you don't miss out on the next video. Or you can always check out my other channels for more awesome content. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully I made your day a little better and I will see you all next time.